You've been playing video games a lot this week. What? No, I haven't. Yeah, it says it's... Yo, what is up guys, and today we're going to be talking about Welcome to My Life. The premise of this show is about a teenage monster named Douglas who attends high school like a normal human being. The story goes on to reveal that he's being interviewed about his life being a monster while attending high school like a normal human being. As the minisode goes on, we learn that Takashi, that's his nickname, is a pretty chill dude with an interesting sense of humor. The show's art style is basically like an improved version of The Amazing World of Gumball. His dad is a five-eyed green monster while his mom is a small like alien green creature. So yeah, you can probably see the resemblance if you've watched the minisode before. So as the minisode goes on, we see how he copes with his normal day at school as we see in the beginning at the start of school, he's in a marine biology class which he finds pretty interesting and pretty amusing which is pretty cool when you think about it. And then after the lesson, he ends up going to lunch with him and his friends and then he gets into an altercation with another guy. Because Takashi said he looks like the human version of him so this made the other guy really pissed off. As the episode goes on, we learn that Takashi is actually more sensitive to be himself because he fears that people are going to treat him differently just because of the way he looks which is kind of depressing when you think about it but it's quite relatable in reality too. So that guy that Takashi said looks like the human version of him challenged him to a fight after 6th period which is basically the last period and then they're gonna fight when school comes out so basically he's gonna like have to train to fight this guy which he doesn't want to do but you know he has to because it's high school. Then later on as the episode progresses we see that he's a huge fan of football because that's where his looks don't matter and he can be himself. And then later on the school bell comes out and he has to fight the bully that he sort of made fun of. So basically now school's out and Douglas is still wearing his headgear from football practice and then he runs into his friend Lucas and then Lucas is wondering like why are you still wearing your headgear to which Douglas explains that he has to fight some dude for calling him the human version of himself. And Douglas's friend Lucas sees the guy who he's supposed to be fighting with and he's trying to figure out why does this nice church going guy want to have a fight with Douglas over such small things you know. So Lucas runs up to this guy who goes to his church and then he's like yo dude like why do you want to fight my friend Douglas over here like what's wrong with looking like him and then he realizes that yeah he actually does have a point and then Douglas and the so called bully end up walking towards each other and shaking hands and then they realize that was just really really stupid so then basically him and the bully become friends and that's basically how the episode ends Douglas goes home his mom comes to pick him up and then the credits roll However, I do not think that Cartoon Network is going to green light, light this show because like this is basically a slow paced show and there's not much you can actually go far with this. He's a monster attending high school. Like how far can that actually last? But anyways guys, if you like the video, please make sure you leave a like down below, comment, share and subscribe and as always, stay awesome. There doesn't seem to me that much of a difference between boys, whether they're monsters or...